Hello, George Burns here. Today I'd like to show you how I made this card. I made this card using the stamp set, hand penned petals from Stampin' Up. And I'm going to be using that image, that image, the reef, the e-fill images, and the leaves. I think I've got them all out. I can always come back if I don't. I'm also using floating and fluttering. And we're going to use this small butterfly, that butterfly. I have cut my stamp up. The infills and the frame. And the sentiment comes from elegantly said. And it's wishing you a wonderful birthday. So, I've got card blank of eight and a quarter by five and seven eighths scored at four and one eighth and two pieces of white basic white at five and five eighths by three and seven eighths so we'll take this I'm going to stamp on that and to start we need soft suede for our butterflies as they are going to be the first ones down and I'm going to pop that one there and we need the other butterfly, what have I done with it? Oh, there it is. This butterfly. Now when I made this card it was an afterthought because that bit was all bare and I stuck that in afterwards. Right, this time I'm going to put it in same time as the other butterfly. Right. Now we need Daffodil Delight to fill in our butterflies. And we just stamp over the top of them and fill them in. I haven't got enough blocks to put all these stamps on. And that one, and we do the same with this one. Now we're going to mask these up like this. we're going to stamp down our flower image using Memento Black Ink. Ink it all up well. And bring that down. We want the leaves poking through. Like that. Now on the other one I did it in flowers in brushing bride. On this one, I'm going to use fresh freesia to colour in our flowers. Right, I've got this is the for these two small flowers here. Now they don't exactly fit because they're supposed to just be a um, smidgen of colour, as I call it. Like that. Um, and we have this one, which is for no, it's this flower. I always get this mixed up. Right. Like that. And that's 
a leaf. This one. This for this flower. And then we have the big flower. Now the leaves I'm doing in soft succulents and no, no, just soft succulents in it. And I've got this is for the big leaf. That and I have the small leaf, which there seems to be more of. Let's go over that one. Hardly any colour showing through for the butterfly. Right, that's all our flowers done. Does that look pretty? Can you see that? I think it looks pretty. Now we want to bring our soft suede back. And use our frame. Oh, now this time. I don't want them flowers um, on here. The frame went like that over the flowers. Well, I don't want that this time. This time I want to put the frame under the flowers. So, I am trying to put the frame straight oh yeah I like that better and then we need the sentiment now I need to make sure this is straight let's Bring up right. there. and that is our card done. Or the stamping done. So what we need is our card base and just need to glue that on top. Now the piece that goes inside we will just stamp with my usual wishing you a wonderful day or birthday or whatever it, fabulous day whatever it says beautiful day and I'm stamping that in uh, soft suede like that And we'll just glue that inside as well. Right. 
Now then we need to add some gems before we glossy the butterflies. Oh, I put two on the inside. Oh, I've nearly finished these ones. And then I put three up here. Right, now I've got some glossy accent here, but I've decanted it into one of these um, fine nib bottles that I have my glue in as well. Now if you don't have this, but you have the um, fine tip glue from Stampin' Up, it is exactly the same as glossy accent and you can do the same with just making sure there's no air bubbles in it and I'm just going over the wings Takes a couple of hours for this to dry, so it's not something you could do, um, you know, if you quickly need a card, because this needs time to dry. Make sure there's no air bubbles in it. Last wing. Right, there we are. Got to keep it flat. And by the way, the idea for this card came from Artful Stamping. Um, she does some fabulous artwork. You need to get over to her channel. She does lovely one sheet wonders and beautiful cards with her one sheet wonders. So if you want to go and check her out at Artful, Stomp, Artful Stamping on YouTube. She also has a Facebook page but I'm not sure what the name is on Facebook. Anyway, that's my cards done. If you like it, give us a thumbs up. And please leave a comment and you can share my videos if you want you subscribe and that way you won't miss any of my videos which is usually a Monday Wednesday and Friday so don't forget forget to press the bell icon and you'll be notified all I can say is thanks for visiting and I hope to see you again soon